What are we gonna do today, guys? Well, I had a package come in, and uh, I was told that this is stuff for the channel. It came in from Winston Cobretti, and it's a big box. So we're gonna open this up. I don't know whether the stuff in it's large. I haven't looked yet. Um, he said there's a few things in there. Um, like there's a box inside a box uh, that's probably for review, but it's all for the channel. It's all for me and PDM. So uh, you guys know what time it is. Turn down the volume. Here comes a little bit of music. <laughs> Before we turn this around, we're gonna unbox this right here. And then I think, cause it feels heavy and it feels like there's some oversized stuff. And I don't think we're gonna be able to look at all of it over at the table. So we may look at some of it here and pull the stuff out. Hopefully none of it's green. Um, but we will look at as much of it as we can at the table. I'm currently unboxing this. The only thing I did was peel address labels. I hope, I hope there's nothing in here that I cut. I just felt the knife hit something inside. Uh, paper, there's paper inside. A little bit of brown butcher paper. So, I'm using my Kubi 344. Thoughtful little gift from my buddy Sharif Mangan. Okay, yeah, so there's some big stuff in here. There's, <laughs> holy crap. There's a Brooklyn Slammer from Cold Steel. We'll take a look at that on the table. Uh, appears to be some clothing and stuff in here and a small box, so. I think most of this stuff we can look at over at the table. So I'm gonna get this stuff all out of the box. And we're gonna look at this from above. All right, guys, let's take a look at this. So the first thing up came from, this all came from Winston Cabretti. He's been awesome, a uh, real benefactor of the channel. Not only is he a paying member, he has sent so much stuff. You remember, he sent me that Lion Steel M3. He sent me the uh, Acheron Bastinelli collab that is always sitting around. So let's get into this and take a look. Let's see what he sent. I'm not sure what's in this. Um, so there's some stuff in here first. There's, uh, let's see here, Merlin Professional Folding Knife Deployment System. Uh, <laughs> CRKT, I don't know what this is. I don't know how this is supposed to work. It says when seconds matter, introduction. So this is a Merlin... Folding knife deployment system. I don't exactly know how it works. Let's see here. Uh, oh, I see. Yeah, I'm going to hate this. <laughs> that looks safe, doesn't it? Let's uh, go ahead and get that out of the way. What else is in here? Um, uh, Boomer. Boomer sticker. <laughs> Boomer. Uh, Boomauer patch. Let's see here. This is, it's a patch that'll go over there on the area over here where all the patches sit. Let's see, what is this? This is Brit Kit USA. Um, if you guys are interested in this, they have an Instagram. Follow them on Instagram, stuff like that. So thank you very much for that patch. What else is in here? Let's see, it appears to be a jacket. Ooh, yeah. This looks like a windbreaker, triple XL hoodie windbreaker from Wash With Blood and Souls from Zero Foxtrot, built for hard fucks. Yeah, we'll, uh, I'll try this on a little bit later, so let's go ahead and get the next thing. The next item is a Cold Steel Brooklyn Slammer. Let's go ahead and pop into this. We'll use our gent. <laughs> These were these were one of Lynn Thompson's things that he used to sell. This is the unbreakable uh, baseball bat. These were uh, composite, plastic, polycarbonate of some sort, and uh, these were marketed for for home defense. So I will tell you, I here in California, if you have this in your car and you don't have a baseball or softball or glove, you are carrying a weapon. Uh, so you got to be careful with these. But this uh, this is nice and heavy. I'm going to put this by the front door. Um, for home defense. So there you go. A Brooklyn Slammer ball bat by Cold Steel. Cold Steel Athletics unbreakable baseball bat. It's relatively short. So I don't think you're going to get much. Like maybe a kid's bat. That thing is heavy though. That is solid. 
So yeah, there we go. That'll be next to the door for uh, answer the door at night. Saving one thing for last, because he did tell me that there's a box inside the box that I'm probably going to get to enjoy. This is another, looks like a 511 tactical radar fleece. Let's just go ahead and pop this open. I don't want to cut the actual item. So yeah, we got, uh, this is all stuff for the channel, all stuff for me, as a matter of fact. So yeah, 511, nice little, nice little fleece. Front pockets. 511 makes some good stuff. Sometimes it's just a little expensive. So yeah, we got a nice little uh, fleece. I'll take pictures of these uh, a little bit later once I get them laid out. Uh, it's just really hard to film it here. Oh, look at that. We can put our, uh, I can put my patches on. Look at that. We'll put our, there we go. Look at that. My rebel scum patch on there. So there we go. Let's get the last item up and take a look at it down a little closer. I have not opened this yet. I got us down a little closer because the item's not as big. Everything else in there, I think the bat was the main reason for such a large box. Um, but uh, let's take a look. I, mean, I keep missing the tape. There you go. Let's get this open and see here. Okay, I figured this is probably a knife. It's a knife-esque case. Don't know for sure yet. Let's go ahead and get all this crap out of the way. Right, let's see here. This opened up. Let's see. Ooh. Ooh, what is this? This is PMK knives. I don't know what model this is. Does it say on the back? Wow. PMK knives. Let's see here. I love when I have to have a knife to open a knife. At least it's not in a bubble pack, you know, a blister pack. Let's see here. Ooh, big boy. So this is the PMK big boy. This is surprisingly light. Uh, so, oh yeah. Uh, you guys know I'm gonna hate that. Wow. Oh wow, nice and thin. 14C28N. This is mine, even guys. This is. He said this is for me. Oh wow. Okay, I like this. First blush, I like it. Uh, pocket clip's probably gonna go. Um, I'll fuck it. I'll probably figure an option out for that of some sorts or add a little bit of tension to that. I don't know, but so far that man, the action on that, listen to that. That sounds good. Bang. Not knees, knives guys. Uh, go, if you don't follow Jared, you absolutely need to go follow Jared. I'm going to tell you right now, he has done so much to support the channel lately. We've like almost tripled our, uh, our view count over the last four days. Yeah, this is great. This is great. I've not seen a PMK knife. This is an attractive knife. I like how it's, I like it. It's plain, but still really attractive. You know, that is a nice thin blade in 14C. I'm going to, I'm not a fan of the edge that's on it right at the moment, but it's super thin. I'm going to put an edge on that. Wow, guys, this is awesome. This is, uh, this is once again, like I said, this came in from Winston Cobretti, one of the paying members. So not only is he supporting the channel on a monthly basis financially, he sent so much stuff. He sent me that Lion Steel M3, the big fixed blade, uh, the Camp Beast. He sent me this. He sent me patches. He sent me shirts. Now I have a couple sweatshirts, a ball bat, and a, and a PMK knife. So big, big shout out to Winston. I appreciate it. So guys, yeah, that's pretty much it. Let's turn this around do some quick final thoughts. Guys, like I said, a bunch of cool stuff sent in by Winston, uh, one of the big supporters of the channel. Not only does he pay on a monthly, he sent so much stuff that we've had on the channel, including the, the shirt I'm wearing right now with my patches already. I got my boom hour and my do something kind for someone shirt. Go follow Zach as well. You know, not just there, it's Zach. Um, guys, that's it on this one. Just a fun unboxing. I thought you'd enjoy it. Uh, if you like the videos, give them a thumbs up. If you don't like them, give them a thumbs down. But pr please try to tell me why. I can't change the content if you don't tell me what you don't like. Uh, if you want to support the channel, it's as simple as like, share, subscribe, drop a comment. It helps force channels up the algorithm. Jared's been helping out a lot, sharing my content in his videos as well. I'm going to try and do the same for Cole. 
um, and other channels. Uh, but if you do want to support the channel financially, there's a ton of ways you can do it. Uh, best way for me personally is for you guys to get in on a membership where you get early access to some videos, exclusive content, um, a lot of different benefits based on tier, uh, gilded server access where we just chat, things like that. And you say five dollars per video or per knife on uh, on my sharpening service, and you also get access as a premium tier member to my sharpening tutorial series. Other ways you can do it. I have a ton of affiliate links down below. Anything you purchase through those affiliate links, I get a portion of it at checkout. It doesn't cost you anything. And the final way is I do have a merchandise store on Ember Shirt Co. I've built a coupon code that works anywhere on Ember Shirt Co. The coupon code is Crazy Sharp, all one word, capital C, capital S, Crazy Sharp. Saves you ten percent at checkout. Guys, that's it. I love y'all. If it's your birthday, happy birthday. Keep it clean in the comment section. It makes it easier to moderate the channel. And I will see you in the next video.